All right, everyone, welcome to another video on my The Crew 2 Let's Play series, sort of. And in this video, I'd like to talk about, well, mainly the reason why I feel Theo has broken The Crew 2, and that is with the farming aspect. If you recall and you watched Black Panther's videos, he made a video kind of a while back during the closed out of beta where he basically made a video saying the biggest problem with The Crew 2. And that video mainly talked about the farming aspect of the crew too, saying that pretty much it doesn't exist and it's just, it doesn't really give that good of a grind. But in my opinion, well, not, it is in my opinion, but basically, now that he's basically said that, the developers have basically broken the entire farming aspect of the game. So as you can see, here's my Lamborghini Huracan. Completely maxed out with level 280 parts. Not a single purple part. I cannot get a single purple part because literally the drop rates of the purple parts are just awful. Half of the time you get no purple parts, you just get blue parts. The other half of the time you'll get purple parts and they're just rubbish and much lower level than what you have. And from what I can see, the developers l took Theo's uh, video a little too seriously and made the grinding aspect a little too... Basically over... Uh, nerfed basically so they basically nerfed the purple parts so much that it's almost impossible to get them i mean you can get them as you can see i've gotten some purple parts but these are not very good purple parts neither is this the purple parts for cars like this the well pretty much for most of the vehicles the boats the planes and the and the land vehicles you gotta get purple parts that have nitrous bonuses on them that'll increase the power of the nitrous or the reef and or the refill of the nitrous but the fact that you can't even get those anymore, and if you do get them with blue parts, they're just basically awful, to say the least. I mean, and then there's also the problem as well. Theo said that in general, the grinding aspect is not there. But, look at the drift cars. I spent the whole entire career, like, farming through all the, the parts, and literally I have not been able to get my car to max level. The drift cars are the biggest pain to get maxed out, because... Most of the time, for pretty much all of the events, you'll only get two parts. That's it. And you so rarely get purple parts and blue parts. And you'll also get kind of crappy ones most of the time. So basically, leveling up drift cars is also a massive pain. Same with drag cars as well. They drop very, very little parts. They only drop like two or three. And very, very rarely drop purple parts as well. I mean, it, they should really add... The way they could probably fix this is, well, number one, is fix the drop drop rates so that they were that so they were before. <clears throat> Excuse me. Or they could add in another difficulty level, so-called Uber, which increases the uh, AI difficulty really, really high to where you need to have a maxed out vehicle in order to farm with them. But in that Uber difficulty, it'll drop purple parts only, and only purple parts, nothing else. And so, yeah, I mean, here's a hypercar as well, as you can see. For the most part, I've got a lot of just garbage blue parts, to be honest, that are not even, not even that good. I mean, there's a lot of them. I can use them to max out hypercars. But then there's the problem of farming for purple parts. I mean, I have purple parts, as you can see. I earned this one before, but it's not the right level. It's lower than what it should be. And like I said, you'll only get one purple part every single time you complete a mission. So, yeah, it's pretty awful. I mean, here's my Koenigs of The This is little, basically the best nitrous part that I've gotten so far. Everything else is just trash. I mean, here's another one right here. But as you can see, these are not useful at all. They're just horrible. Here's my McLaren P1. Again, not very good parts. Same with my 918. Not very good parts. And I haven't bothered maxing these out yet because... Yeah, I just wanted to focus on street for the most part. Then again, the the dirt cars, not very good parts either. And of course, I mean, watching like my friend Speed Booster as well, playing through the game, he's getting mostly, every single time he's gotten parts, for the most part, they're just basically lower level parts. And that's really not the way it should be. Progression, that's not the way progression works. Progression should make your vehicle level higher for the most part, not lower. That's just not progression at all, in that case. I mean, I get it. There should be farming. But not to this level. It's just horrible in that case. So, let's take my McLaren P1 and I'll play Latrell's Car, uh, Latrell's Car Part 2, and show you guys just how bad the farming is. I mean, I played a mission, the mission before and I actually made a previous video, which was a little bit more harsh from what I 
thoughts, so I deleted it and I decided to re-record it. Just, I don't want to bash Black Panther too much, but honestly, he kind of deserves it because he broke the game quite badly by doing that video. And I'm lagging quite a bit. I'm only getting like 50 frames a second because I'm recording at the same time. I really need to get a better system. Because this is not working out. My 1060 is not working out since it's only 3 gigs. It's probably maxing out the video RAM most of the time. Woo! Back behind the wheel again. And in a beast like this, what a feeling. I do have to say, the only other aspects of the game are perfectly fine. I like the storyline. Although I do feel they should add more longer races, especially with the hypercars. There should be like one and two hour long races for hypercars. That would be awesome. But that's not the main part of the video. I mean, if you're watching this Black Panther, my apologies for like being very harsh towards you. But honestly, you really broke the game just by uh, that video alone. I mean, other people would have probably like contradict me but frankly the fact that you can't get purple parts really that easily anymore i mean saying that it's kind of basically saying that i don't like farming i like farming but this is too extreme way too extreme i mean there's like farming on like forces levels where basically you don't even need to farm you just buy the parts that you need but in this case you can't even buy parts the, the, how, the area for buying parts does not exist in the HQ. Like with the first game. So, I'm driving like a dumbass a little bit. And my FPS is kind of bad too, so I really do need to get a better system. But anyway. Back to the main point. The fact that you can't buy parts really makes the whole entire farming process even worse. I mean, I'd be fine with the, with the increase in... Uh, with the... Uh, the decrease in drop rates if there was an ability to buy parts from the thing but the fact that you can't even buy parts that makes the whole entire farming aspect like 10 times worse it's really bad i mean when the legendary parts come out it'll probably be a little bit better but that's not gonna be for like another three months so basically we're gonna be stuck with this and i apologize for any background noise some neighbors are having yard work done if you're hearing like lawnmowers and crap I mean again I'm not trying to bash Theo I don't dislike him that much I just don't agree with certain things that he has to say like in this case the farming aspect of the crew too I, I completely disagree with that the fact that he basically ignored the fact that the purple parts exist just basically infuriates me and now they're just broken Racing, how I missed you. man I picked a perfect time to make vi make this video because you can even hear it no, you can't really hear it, because it gets cut out a little bit. But yeah, here we are. Let's see what the drop rate is like. And not a single purple part. Just green parts. Even though this... By the way, I'm playing on hard. And it should be only dropping per blue parts. But I got green parts. Like, what the heck? I mean, there's a 320 part, but that's not useful to me. I'll just keep it, though. There's another 320 part. But again, not a single blue part in here either. Or, well, this purple part doesn't count, because it's lower level. And it doesn't help me. But, yeah. Like I said in the beginning of this video. Uh, they really need to... F uh, Theo basically screwed up the whole entire game. That's all that I really have to say about that. And the developers really need to revert this back. To how it was before. At least with the purple parts. I don't mind the whole entire like longer farming aspect with the game. But the purple parts need to be fixed. They desperately needs to be f need to be fixed. Because this is ridiculous. The fact that I can't even get purple parts. And there's even an achievement that calls for Mac, uh, getting a vehicle with all purple parts. So it's very, very hard to get that. The only way you could really get that is if you mix and match parts between different levels. That's the only way I got it. 
but for the most part, it should be max out a vehicle with purple parts. I think, well, it probably would have been like that, but after they mo changed the drop race, they probably switched that achievement out so that it doesn't require you to have a maxed out vehicle with purple parts. But, yeah. That's pretty much it for this video. I hope the developers will fix this, but uh, they probably won't fix this since I'm a smaller YouTuber, and they probably won't care towards my opinion since they think I don't have that big of an audience and my opinion doesn't matter. But, yeah, that's it for this video. I uh, hope you guys enjoyed, and again, don't hate on this video because I'm bashing on Black Panther. That's, this is just my opinion, the fact that the whole entire farming aspect is broken. And a lot of my other friends are thinking the exact same thing. Speed Booster thinks the exact same thing. I don't know about Arctic Games, I didn't ask him towards that, but Speed Booster has mainly been like pissed off since the whole entire like farming aspect has been broken since the previous beta. So yeah, that's it for this video. Catch you guys on the next one. Bye.